outside of the world of stand-up comedy, are men and women really that different? Not according to this new study, which suggests that we're pretty much exactly the same. Hey guys, Lacey here. And Trace, and seriously, the jokes about how men and women are different can finally be put to rest. That's right. A new study released this week in the Journal of Social Psychology found that men and women aren't from Mars or Jupiter or Venus and that we're both actually from Earth. But if we're not from Mars, that's like my only shot to get to go there. Sorry. We're not saying that men and women are exactly the same. I mean, there are obviously physical differences like hip to waist ratio and whatnot. We're talking psychologically, where we're actually pretty similar. Yeah, the researchers at the University of Rochester analyzed 13 published studies and then compiled it with their own data for 122 different characteristics from empathy to extroversion, scientific inclination to sexuality. The statistical analysis of over 13,000 individuals found that gender stereotypes aren't really entrenched in our lived reality. So, for instance, women were not significantly more intimate in relationships, men weren't overwhelmingly more scientifically inclined, and so on. Gender can be a predictor of stereotypes, but these psychologists suggested that the ideas are socially encouraged through a reward and punishment system, you know, approval, disapproval. On some social level, we expect to see behavior based on gender, so in our mind, we make it happen. Another foundational tenet in the field of human sexuality is that people, gender, and even sex don't fit neatly into little boxes. People are complicated. Women exhibit masculine traits like being assertive and competitive and demonstrating leadership, and men exhibit feminine traits like being domesticated, nurturing, and empathetic. Both genders have both characteristics. It's just sort of a continuum. And like the researchers said, it's not really categorical. It's more a matter of degree. So Trace, what do you think about this groundbreaking revelation? Well, even in this study, they found overlap. Like you said, it's not that women are displaying man traits or men are acting more woman-like. It's more that we think that might be what's happening, but in our heads, we're just overlapping all the time. It's We're just being human-like, human-ish. Yeah. When you think about it, those characteristics are sort of arbitrary anyway. They're mm -hmm. human characteristics. Absolutely. So we realize that for some folks, this kind of research is controversial, and for others, it's common sense. So we want to know what you think about it, if you have any thoughts in your brain. And make sure you subscribe to DNews so you can get all of our awesome videos, two a day, every day of the week. So thanks for watching. See you later.